We'll guide you through how to live stream on Twitch. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, come to Twitch. To go and get started with streaming, you need an account. So go to the top right and you can press on sign up or log in if you already have one. Then you can go and tap your profile icon in the top right and press create a dashboard. You can come over to the left and click stream manager. Now, what we can do is we can start setting this up in quick actions, click edit stream info and start filling in the title, the category and other parts like that and press done when you're ready. Now to start streaming, we need to get the software. So head to the top so you can open up a new tab and the software I like to use is called OBS. That stands for open broadcast software. This is free and open source. So go and choose the system you use and you can download it and install it. So I've already got OBS installed, so open it up. Yours will look very similar. I've probably got more scenes than you. Make sure you've got a scene in here, and then you can go over to the right and you can press settings. Now you want to come over to the left into stream. In service, go and select Twitch, and you can press connect account. After you've made the connection, you'll go and get these pop up, the stream information and chat. If you can't go and access them, try pressing on one of them, pressing control, and then using your mouse wheel to zoom out then you should be able to press a button. Now let's get these settings set up. So in settings, come over to the left and press output and you can set the mode to simple. For the bit rate, you can set it to 6,000. I don't change the audio bit rate. For the encoder, if you've got the option for hardware, you can use that, otherwise use software. For the encoder present, I just use one in the middle. Then you can press apply. Come into audio on the left and you can go and choose your mic and you can then go and choose the desktop audio as well. Then you can go and press apply. Come over to the left of video. For the base canvas, you can set that to 1920 by 1080 and do the same thing for the output scaled resolution as well. You can set the frame rate to 60 as that makes things smooth. Press apply and okay. Now we can add some sources. So select your scene and you can then press the plus at the bottom and you can go and select display capture and we can add in our display. Choose the display you want to do this with. I'll do my primary monitor and press OK. Then you can go and resize it to make sure that it fits. You can use the corner points to do that. And you can then add more sources by pressing the plus. For example, to add a webcam, you click video capture device and OK. And you can then go and choose the device here. I haven't got any to add, so I'll press cancel. And there are more things you can add there as well. So when you're then ready, you can go and press start streaming. You may need to refresh the page, but you can now see that we're live.